Good morning, you lovely people. Welcome along to Friday. Yeah, we're back here again at the beginning of the weekend. Apparently the weather is meant to be really, really good. Of course, a bit chilly this morning. Yeah, it's meant to be really, really good this weekend. Uh, if you're an able-bodied person, you're probably going into your lovely garden, doing some gardening work during the day, mowing the grass, and then having a barbecue in the afternoon. Me, I'll be thinking of it. I really would. Or thinking about going down the beach, having a walk on those pebbly sands that we've got down the road here, and then a nice dip in the sea. That would be nice. Yeah, my body in water, immersed in water, hasn't happened for a bloody long time. Uh, oh, you can live and dream, can't you, eh? You can live and dream. Well, for me dinner last night, I had a repeat of the night before. But yes, I finished off the homemade shepherd's pie with spaghetti hoops. And some bread and butter. Yum, yum. With me rice pudding to follow. Very nice it was too. Tracy had a fully loaded pepperoni lasagna with some chips. And Siobhan had something and chips. I don't know what. Probably chicken nuggets knowing her. I didn't get that close to the kitchen to find out. Uh, what else? What else? It's all right. If, you, if I'm looking weird... Over here, I've got an abscess. Oh, I have got a few teeth, and uh, that one's virtually ready to come out, and uh, it hurts. Poor old me. Poor old me. Yeah. Oh, uh, never mind. <laughs> it all come out in the wash. Wash of ones at work today with her friend across the road, Michelle, earning some more pennies to pay for her driving licence. And next Saturday, oh, next Saturday, she's got a theory test. <gasps> God help me if she fails, I won't be happy. Every five minutes she's doing a prep, an online driving theory test, so uh, she keeps passing. But it's not what she does online, it's what she actually gets on the day, I suppose, that makes all the difference. It was hard enough when I'd done it all them years ago. Mind you, she's good at remembering things, uh, apart from the maths. She's now got to fill out a form for the... Uh, for a grant for next year at college. That's uh, to pay for her meals and her travelling expenses. Get her out of my hair for a few hours a day and her mother's. Uh, Tuesday she's back at hospital. Yep. Doing her volunteering work. She's got a lovely NHS pass with her name on it. Shame I spelt Davison as Davidson. D-A-V-I-D-S-O-N. Well it's not, it's D-A-V-I-S-O-N. Uh, now, if you're named Davison, the way we had our name is spelled, if people put a D in it, you go a bit spacky. My granddad used to, oh, I do, Siobhan does. Tracy doesn't care, because she's a Mills. <laughs> Tracy, uh, speaking of Mills, she spoke to her mum yesterday. Mum's doing all right. She's promised that she'll be going up to see her within the next week and a bit. Which will be nice. Uh, I'll probably get my lovely friend Jojo and the girls to come look after me while Tracy's up there. Uh, Jojo came round yesterday with the girls. She brought me a lovely bit of bread pudding. Oh -ho! Naughty girl, she knows I'm diabetic. Tigger Davison, can you not go out the door, please? Tracy, your cat's about to go wandering. He's a... Uh, we put like a stable door up at our front door to stop not only Tango getting out, to stop the others coming in. Now Tigger finds it quite amusing to jump over the said stable door and go out the front. Hey. Well, she don't mind because he does come back. But it'll be the time that he goes and he doesn't come back. And then we'll, me and Tracy get it in the head off as Siobhan. Yeah, she will moan at us like you won't believe. What can we do? Not a lot. No. Anyway, got to say hello to the normal rabble. Angie, Rob, uh, Nicole, Rosie, Joey, Amelia, Gav. Come back on Messenger, mate, and talk to us. We're going pretty mad about having a good, decent reason to moan at somebody. <laughs> Lucy, James and Emily. I hope you have a fantastic weekend. He's up there again. Oh, no, he's going. 
Oh, well, I've got to go, I'm afraid. I've got to stop the cat from running off. Right, I'll talk to you tomorrow. Love you lots. Ta-ra.